Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of React JS. So today we are going to implement such a basic slider. You can see that. So I have implemented this basic slider. So you need such kind of things in your project. So you need to use this slider if you want, right? So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel and hit like to this video. Okay, so let's get started. So how we are going to build this kind of sliders in uh, React JS. So let's get see. Okay, so I, I have used a package that is called the React slider, React responsive slider. You can see that there is a React responsive cross, right? I have used and you can see that. So here we have just added this uh, crossl.js and here we have the crossl. From, this is the crossl which you have built and this is the lip, uh, mini, uh, CSS from the React responsive crossl, right? In the crossl, just we have added the all the images. Okay, so you can see that we created the, all the dev images and wrap into a crossl that is autoplay, right? You can see that there is a crossl with autoplay functionality. Okay, and here we have some more things that we can use. Okay, let's see. We have you can see that crossl. This is a this is a, uh, easy crossl, right? So they have some properties. So let's try to use some of the properties that they have. Okay. And they have a dynamic height, emulator to touch, infinite loop, everything. They have the functionality over here, render top and everything. Okay. So where we go with this one? So you can also go with, take an example of this one. It has too much downloads of that one. Okay. You can see that. So let's take an example of here. Index. Okay. And uh, what we are just looking forward to it. Just we need to pass cross. And these are the div that uh, help into making the cross over here. Okay. And you can see that. We are successfully just it's very easy just cross and just you need to pass out the images whether you want to play with the links whether you want to play with anything you can just uh, add it over here and it will create a slider auto automatically if you want to implement such more functionalities like autoplay you need to change the icons you need to hide the icons or something like this so uh, we, we can also do that okay in that uh, note also so uh, if you want that part like uh, customization of that custom things to be added in the crossl.js you just write me in, in the comment section i will uh, give, uh, upload a full tutorial on that okay for now that's it for today or any issue any query any doubt in that just let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day